Hey everyone, Eamon here, back with Legend of Korra Season 2 Finale. Um, yeah, excited to get into this. Been a, been a really, really good ride the last few episodes especially. Um, yeah, the whole Vatu story is really cool. Um, Unalak, like, potentially merging with him is also, like... Yeah, I was kind of confused about Unalak for a while there, but yeah. That, that storyline makes makes a lot of sense and seems like it could be really 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 cool having like a dark avatar dark versus light that's always a always a good uh it's a, I guess it's a trope but it's like i mean yeah what light versus dark good versus evil it's that's yeah it's like a foundational uh little story point there um yeah i don't have too much to say i just kind of want to hop into this and watch it um i guess yeah we i we just hit 100 subs i noticed uh so thanks a ton uh, i'm not sure how many of you guys are here for cora and for my other stuff but yeah thanks a ton for for the subs um i guess our next goal is a thousand um probably take a while but excited excited to try to get to that next little milestone um yeah make sure hop on the discord if you're not in there yet uh sub if you're not like the video comment Make sure to yeah make make sure to flood the comments with stuff that I might have missed throughout and your thoughts and all that stuff. I'm definitely curious about how how the sh this show was like received when it came out, because um, I know all, like lots of shows end up being like people love them like years later and stuff. But I'm, I'd be curious to know. I'm, I'm assuming it was pretty well received when it came out, but let me know. Um, yeah, uh, do I have any predictions? Um, predictions. Predictions not really i feel like it's yeah vatu is gonna fuse with with uh with unalak it's probably not gonna go well for unalak i'd assume it goes more the way where vatu is like in control of him or like yeah i, I don't really see any way unalak ends up uh in a good in a good situation um yeah cora will save the day i do think T tenzin's gonna play a big role i feel like they've kind of been like They've been like blue balling him all, all season, and I guess his whole life kind of. He's always kind of wanted to be be more important than he has been so far, like spiritually and just like overall. Like he obviously has a big, really important job, like continuing on the Airbender legacy. But I think he's wanted something more. Um, obviously, that's hard living in like Avatar Aang's shadows. Um, but yeah, I think he's going to be really important this episode. I'm hoping he doesn't die, but I I could see him dying. I could see him dying. Uh, to save like Janora and Korra potentially. Um, yeah, do I have anything else? Are, are we gonna get another any reveal, crazy reveals? That would be cool. It'd be cool to see like one of our old friends pop up again. I know we did. We just saw Ira last episode or last was that last episode or the episode four? Last upload at least we saw Ira, so that'd be really cool to see see another character pop up again that we haven't seen. Um, Maybe maybe Katara comes and does some crazy stuff. Um, yeah, that'd be cool. She's a bit old though, but I'm sure she could still. She could probably kicks some ass still. I'm sure. Um, anyways, yeah, let's just hop into it. Chapter thirteen: Darkness Falls. Nothing could stop this moment. Our moment right into it. is upon us again. Hmm. Nice, nice. Don't let Unalak back in the spirit oh, world. Sick, okay. It. That was smart. Let's go 1v1. 2v1. <laughs> Ooh. Genara. Genara that was a great, great start. Me? We can't just randomly wander the spirit world, call out for Janora, and expect to find her. Do spirits she also flew leave away. Or she, she, she was also taken away by like, a bird, right? Her flying bunny. Work. <laughs> We're in the spirit world. There's spiritual energy in every direction. <laughs> we need a spirit guide. Are they going to find Iroh? Spirit, hello. I'm sorry to disturb you. Uh-oh. Humans uh, in the spirit world belong in one place. Is, okay, that is terrifying. Why does it have a little star on its head? <laughs> well, that didn't work. 
Now where are we? We are completely lost. Hmm. Okay, they're gonna run into Iowa. They got it. Ooh. Oh. Oh, what the? No. Uh, okay, that's not good. I've seen that same spirit mushroom five times. <laughs> that's not the same mushroom. Yes, I am. See, <laughs> even it knows we're lost. Oh, sure. Listen to a yes, fungus over your own brother. <laughs> mushroom? Is that you? Nope, wasn't me. <laughs> it's Iro. It's Iro. Let's go. Iro? How? Where? It's been so long. Almost forty years. Oh, Iro lived long enough for them to. Again. They met him. Okay. How did you know we were here? My friendly spirit fox told me you were lost. <laughs> I came to show you the way out. We're looking for my daughter. I'm sorry to hear that, but you shouldn't be here. If you travel too deep into the spirit world, you could end up in a place where only the lost will ever find you. Ooh, okay. I can find you. Hmm. That's it. I know where to find Janora. Okay. That's good. Nice, nice. There you go. Good job. That Cora looks different in this episode. Is it just her hair looks different, or...? Is her hair usually down like that? I don't even know. No, it's usually up, isn't it? Yeah. I think. I might, I might be talking nonsense. I'm Let's go. For years, Let's go. Not going to be that easy, but yeah, Runelock is going to get in where it is. Hello. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Trust me. Hey, you! Spirit! Wake up! Ah. That was his plan? Oh my god, okay. This is a prison. Welcome to the fog of lost souls. Interesting. Come on, go quicker, go quicker. That looks so cool. Yeah, the lock popped in just in time. Come on, turn, turn on your father, turn on your father. Nice. Yeah, great. No! Shit. Holy. Whoa. Spirits and humans will begin, and I will lead them all as the new avatar. The fog is actually a spirit that infects your mind and slowly drives you mad. I am Zhao the Conqueror. Oh, I am the Moon Slayer. I will oh, capture wow. the avatar. Okay. There's Zhao. I will capture the avatar. You're him. Uh oh, the last airbender. Uh oh, ah, no, face me. <laughs> I am Zhao the Conqueror. I will capture you. Jesus. Oh shit. Uh oh. Cora, this fight is not over. Let's go wherever. Do not give in to ten thousand years of mm -hmm. darkness. You are the Avatar. Bang. Da -da. You cannot win. The yellow. You're gonna eat every last one of us. Ah! Who are you two? That's no, not good. You are just a vision. I have no family. Hmm. You can't tie me down. Come on, Tenzin. 
You gotta, you gotta interact with the spirit. Figure what the spirit's issue is. Please, let us out! His groveling is pathetic. But I do enjoy the sweet scent of desperation. <laughs> Why would you protect someone who doesn't care about you at all? Father mm. was going to let me expire when <laughs> expire? the northern portal. <laughs> no. <laughs> don't listen to him. His Shut up, Aubrey. Poisoning your mind. <laughs> <laughs> That'll never get to be with you again. Oh my god. What? I'm never gonna get that <laughs> Genius. I was scared of my true feelings for you. Oh, I should have never left you. Oh <laughs> shit, it's gonna work. Bowen's like dying inside. Let's go. Hmm. Wow, that was the best acting I've ever seen. <laughs> you completely fooled her. Yeah, right. That that was acting. Ooh, okay, interesting. Okay. So he does actually have feelings for him. Yeah, go help them. Come on, go help. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Oh, okay, they're both of them are attached together by the water right now. Uh, okay, that's not good. What the? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, he's, he pulled right. Oh my god. Oh my god, okay. She's not the avatar anymore. Oh my god. Okay, so, yeah, would Korra still be able to... to bend without Rava? Maybe she can just water bend without Rava, but she can't do the rest. I'm, I'm not sure how that works exactly, but yeah, that is insane. Okay. Who you are, Tenzin. You really are curious how this is gonna go. You are the hope for future generations of Airbenders. Uh oh, how are they gonna get out of this? Is Ira gonna come? hope for the future dies with you. That's not good. Ang. Okay, he's he's starting to go crazy. Future generations. Oh, let's go in. Hello, my son. Let's go. You are trying to hold on to a false perception of yourself. Yeah. You are not me, and you should not be me. Mm hmm You are Tenzin. Nice. <laughs> I am Tenzin. I am Tenzin. Let's go. Wow. Oh my god. Okay, there's so many people. Jinora. Jinora. Wait, wait, what's wrong with her? Why are they all... Oh, the fog's still there. He could just see clearly. Okay, okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. What happened? Dad. <laughs> going to be okay, sweetie. I'm here. Interesting. Okay, the butterflies are like... Oh. Okay, what's going to happen here? This is... Dude, what is going to happen? I don't even know what... Oh, okay. She's still there. God, yeah, it's, they're like disappearing. They're like the they're, they're being destroyed each each one. Oh my god, dude, this guy is just a psycho, man! Holy crap! Oh my god! And now the world's in trouble. I have to go help. Oh, what? Jinora, oh. Whoa, my God. Yeah. See you later, Unalak. You are toast. Now, 10,000 years Jesus. of darkness begin. Holy crap. No! Oh. Jesus. Holy crap. Alright, I'm also I'll, I'll, I'm not even gonna take my headphones off. I'm just gonna do a quick quick thing. So yeah, so so Rava is like destroyed. 
is from what I understand, right? So why why did he mean why did he say ten thousand years of darkness? Does that mean Rava will come back in ten thousand years? Um, I th I, th I think there was some they said something about how like like there are there were always kind of there will always kind of be like a balance that is like there, but yeah. But Rav is destroyed. Usually they get like locked away, right? Not destroyed. But they, it's like impossible to destroy them, but it seems like she was destroyed. Or maybe just reset, I guess, maybe. But yeah, so the avatars are like, they're gone. Like they're, they're not there. They're, yeah. So I'm very curious to see what's going to happen there. Like, is she... There's still two more seasons, right? So I'd assume that like she becomes the Avatar again, but I don't know how exactly um, without Rava. Um, maybe and it, and it, can she enter? Can she even bend? I, I don't. I don't think we got clarification if she can bend. I think she, she must be able to bend, right? Because yeah, yeah, Juan could bend before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so Rava is just the one that kind of combined it just to maximize their power. So she still should be able to bend. I'd assume. Just yeah, she won't have the avatar state or like all that all that good stuff. So yeah, maybe she can energy bend. She can energy bend um Ivatu somehow. Make him turn him, him turn him light, maybe, or squeeze some light out of him to make another Rava. I don't I don't know. Something something like that is what I'd assume we'll go with. Um yeah, let's just hop the next one though. I don't really have much else to say. Chapter 14 Light in the Dark. Okay, yeah, light in the dark kind of... That's what I was saying about Korra maybe energy bending Batu. To like, get the light out of the darkness, maybe? I don't know. That can mean so many other things, though. Yes, Mr. President. But I need to know what kind of enemy we're dealing with. You're dealing with Satan, General Iro. Oh my god. Literally like Satan incarnated. Jeez. Time to take back the physical world. Yeah, it's not gonna do shit to him. No, that's symbolic. Jeez, cool, cool transition. Vatu won. No, I am too young to live through ten thousand years of darkness. <laughs> Can't you talk to one of your past lives or something? Nope. He destroyed my connection to the past avatars too. I'm the last avatar. I'm so sorry, Tenzin. <laughs> she needs you now, more than ever. Okay. We did learn just from that dialogue, though. From that dialogue, we did learn that the... <clears throat> did we? No. I was going to say that like we learned that the avatars are still out there. They're just her connection severed, but that also seemed to... Maybe not. Maybe they're gone forever. I don't know. Well, we'll find out, I'm sure. I'm going to destroy the entire city. The world, you mean? Uh-oh. Jesus. We're going down. Let's go in. Jeez, what a shot. What's with all the vines? How does she have that? <laughs> uh oh. Okay. <laughs> there may still be a way for you to stop Vatu. Mm -hmm. And connect with your inner spirit. Yeah, just be have yourself. You heard anything I said? Rava is gone. Rava is mm -hmm. not who you are. Okay. What does he have to show? This is the tree of time. Okay. And the legends say that its roots bind the spirit and physical worlds together. And uh, you think this tree can help me somehow? Yes. Okay. That that's I what the vines are go. that Vatu is using. Meditate beneath this tree and connect with the great cosmic energy of the universe. Okay. Oh. These are my memories. Mm -hmm. You have always been strong, unyielding, and fearless. <laughs> Before he fused with Rava, Juan was just a regular person. He became a legend because of who he was, not what he was. <laughs> You have yeah, to help them. The whole world. How? Do as the ancients once did. Connect to the cosmic energy of the universe. Don't bend the elements, but the energy within okay. yourself. Okay. Yeah, she's an energy bend. You really think I can do this? I have no doubt. Interesting. 
Yeah, there's there's this there's a slowed version of the Avatar theme. He cannot destroy light any more than I can destroy yeah. darkness. Yeah, they can't be destroyed. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The other. yeah, yeah. Find the light in the dark. Yeah. Oh shit. There's a thumbnail right there. Thank you for making it easy for me. Legend of Korra creators. <laughs> oh my god. So cool. The giant Korra. Oh my god, okay. Uh, what did you think of her exactly? <laughs> and it's like, holy shit. Oh shit. Let's go, Korra. Spirit, Spirit Korra? What would that be called here? Yeah, Spirit Korra? Jeez, let's go. She's huge. <laughs> He's just like, what the hell? Here we go. Jeez. She can do it too? Whoa. Ooh, the sound effects. God damn. Oh, okay. No, it's impossible for Rava to be destroyed, though. Didn't they just say that? There will always be light, so Rava has to be, like, a, she's somewhere. Some portion of her is somewhere. They're coming for Korra. Let's go, guys. Ooh, that looks so cool. All this, all the, uh, they're like a four-man avatar. <laughs> Come on, get up. Korra, get up. Get up, get up, get up. Get up, get up. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Leave my golem alone. <laughs> <laughs> let's face the end of the world together. Wasn't Ari Paz in a movie like End of the World or something? I think I remember watching that. Looking for someone to Yeah, something like that. Come on, Cora. Oh, what is What? What is she Be doing? <laughs> Janora is like some crazy spirit, spiritual person. He smokes. Whoa! Holy crap! It's so bright. No. There, there she is. Let's go, Janora. Janora was able to like find her, I guess. The the tiny piece of her left. Yes. The music's going crazy. A spear bend now? Yeah. Let's go. Go in peace. Mm. Harmonic convergence is nearly over. Jeez, Janora's like... Super powerful. The spirits kind of look out of place now, uh, animation style wise. They didn't before, but now they do. Nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'll see you soon, Dad. Yeah, where? Something's up with Janora. Oh man, the music's so good. Oh, she went back to her body. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry. They're all right. Cora saved the world. She's like super spiritually enlightened, sounds like. <laughs> Let's go, Cora. <laughs> They're like dancing back together. Toss 
spirit has returned. Is he gonna still remember though? Let's see. Okay. And the way you turned all gigantic like that, wow! <laughs> I just wish Varric had been here to film it! I'm sorry mm -hmm. about your father, but he was already fused with Vatu. It seems Cousin Cora is under the impression we are saddened by our father's demise. <laughs> Desna and I must return home. But Interesting, said, okay. Eternal darkness was upon us. <laughs> I became caught up in the moment. Oh my god. Yeah. She's breaking up with him. That's I guess fine. I did too. I will remember you fondly, my turtle duck. <laughs> the Bum dragonfly you, bunny. Are you also reconnected to your past lives? No. Yeah, okay. I think that's that a, link is gone forever. That's what I was thinking, yeah. Maybe I shouldn't. What if Unalop was right when he said the Avatar shouldn't be a bridge between the two worlds? Mm. What if Avatar Wan made a mistake when he closed the portals? Ooh. What if humans and spirits okay. weren't meant to live apart? Interesting, interesting. I think you should trust your instincts. There is nothing else I can teach you. Okay, I'm going to leave him open. I've been wanting to tell you about that fight we had. I, I broke up with you. I remember. Oh, but okay. being inside the Tree of Time brought it back. Hmm. Us doesn't work. You're mm -hmm. right. I love you, Cora. And I'll always love you. <laughs> you want a hug? <laughs> <laughs> the Water Tribes will always be allies. But the Southern Tribe is now independent! I've realized that even though we should learn from those who came before us, we must also forge our own path. Yeah, Why can always I've improve. I've decided to keep the portals open. Spirits will be free to roam our world. Humans mm. and spirits must learn to live together. Harmonic convergence has caused a shift in the planet's energy. I can feel it. Things will never be the same again. We are entering a new age. Nice. Okay. So cool. There we go. All right. So that was season two, Legend of Korra. Really good stuff. Really good stuff. Start started out a little slow for me. Um, like the season, not not the episode. Um, started out slow, but like amazing ending. Some crazy, some crazy battle scenes. Um definitely more of like a um a lore impacting show or season i guess like i think season one i think i liked season one more it was more like gritty and like realistic kind of i guess would be the word and the kid the the bad guy was obviously a really cool character um season two was more of like a, a yeah like a grand scale like lore and lore, like really deeply lore intensive um light versus dark all the, all that good stuff classic classic storyline type stuff um yeah but like universe expanding i guess would be the the word for for season two um i think yeah i think it was a go yeah godric i think godric mentioned that this season was kind of this finale i guess was kind of um was it what is that what godric said apologies if we get this wrong i think it's i think it's what godric said but he said like um some people didn't like how this ended um, or like the ramifications of what what occurred um i believe is what he said um and i can i can see why if that if that is, was the case um because there obviously are some is some major like lore stuff that got like introduced or maybe taken away kind of um especially with the avatar um the history of the avatar being like the links gone i guess um so i'm curious if that will somehow get worked back into the story but um yeah i, I like the overall message of like um like just because things are done a certain way in the past doesn't mean they should always do them that way in the future um that's like true in real life as well like let's lots of people always look back on like stuff in the like the good old days and stuff and like think it should always be that way but like society's goal is like to be to improve upon itself it shouldn't just like stay the same it can, it can always be better right so um Yes, yeah, so that's cool. The whole sp yeah, spirits roaming through the world. Um, that I, that would there will be some issues with that, obviously, with spirits in the world, because there obviously are some spirits that aren't good, right? Like, yeah, not all the spirits are good. I think, unless that was more. Yeah, yeah, not all spirits are good, right? So that yeah, 
there will there'll be some issues with that, but obviously uh, overall I think it's best if that's the way they do it. Um, but yeah, so yeah, some cra crazy visuals, crazy crazy scenes. Um, yeah, was there anything else? Uh, yeah, it was nice seeing I Iro. I, I didn't realize Iro like live long enough to meet um, Aang's kids, so that that's cool um, that they had met before. Um, Janora, Janora seemed to like level up. Um, when she returned from the spirit world she seemed weird so i don't know if that might be a plot line going forward because she seemed kind of like um uh spoiler warning for any people that haven't seen game of thrones um he she seemed kind of like like bran when he became the three-eyed raven she seemed like really like robotic sounding and like yeah like as if she wasn't the same person or she was but like yeah like not at the same time um yeah, that was a little weird so i'm assuming something might have occurred to her there um maybe she's a major player in the future seasons I, i'm not sure um seems like it'd be a waste if she's not um with, with how like she she seems important yeah she obviously seems seems really important um especially with obviously with the spirits now being like in the real world um or in the in the human the physical world um but yeah what do we need to cover anything else um what else happened that might have changed some stuff um no i think that's good for that um but yeah really like the season um season one I th yeah i think i like season one but they're both really good um it's all it's crazy coming from like well, like i remember like watching like season one of avatar and then to this like the change in how like the animation style is one thing but like just like the scope of the show is like another it's crazy how much it's like uh evolved i guess from from then um yeah yeah so I'm, yeah i think that, that yeah that's good enough for season two yeah yeah really enjoyed it um i guess we'll we'll discuss like season three i believe i read a comment that says season three is considered like like the best of avatar and Korra, the season three of Korra. so i'm excited for that if, if that's the case I, I don't, i'm gonna try to temper expectations though i don't want to get too carried away with um expectations because obviously that can lead to people uh not appreciating it as much when you when your expectations are so high but um if that's the case that's really re looking forward for that um don't really have any idea what the plot would be um something to do with spirits again i guess maybe um yeah uh, and i'm very curious about who else is gonna show up in in the season because yeah we still haven't we still haven't really seen we haven't seen zuko um we haven't seen Zuko's kid, I don't think, because we, we saw Zuko's, that's uh, General Iroh's Zuko's grandson, I believe, right? So we haven't seen Zuko's kids either. We haven't seen um, what happened to Toph, or not, not yeah, Toph. Um, also, haven't seen what happened to uh, Sokka. Uh, we haven't seen what happened to, oh man, the the Kyoshi warriors. We haven't seen what happened to, uh, yeah, what's her, what are, what's her name, Sokka's love interest? I forget her, I forget his love interest. Um, I haven't seen it happen to so so many characters from Avatar, and I'm assuming they're going to pop up. Like, there's no way we don't get some backstory in them. So, um, I mean, it's possible, but I'd be shocked if we don't get to see all of them. Um, what happened to them, at least, if they're not alive. Um, yeah, and yeah, I don't really know what else could could occur. Um, Oh, we did see Varric. Varric got away. He escaped, so that'll be something to. to he, he'll pop up eventually, but like he's not like evil, right? He's just like a. I mean, you can define e evil different ways. Like, I, I would consider him evil, even though his like he's not. He's just trying to make money, but like the shit he does is all is evil. So, like that's generally. Um, if you're that rich, you're generally a shitty person. So, <laughs> for the most part, unless you're like. There's barely any examples of that not being true. Um, maybe the guy who owns Costco <laughs> is like one of the one of the few. Um, yeah, that's a, that's all I can think of. Um, but yeah, so yeah, season three. We'll start up season three. I'm gonna try to. Hmm, I'm not gonna commit to a date. I was gonna say like Monday, so we skip we skip like one one upload. But I, I might I might stretch it a bit because I am, man. Yeah, you guys know, I've been so lazy this past month. I've been like super busy and then it's just so lazy when I do have the time. I've just been lazy and not been wanting to edit or anything. So I might take, we might do a week between um, uploads uh, just so I can catch up on my, uh, there's a bunch of stuff I've been trying to like, 
do for my other channel that um kind of takes like kind of takes priority i guess i, I don't want to say it takes priority but that channel is a lot, a lot bigger at the moment so i'm i gotta i gotta make sure i get kept caught up on it because it's um yeah it's it's more of a yeah i, I yeah we'll see we'll see I, I gotta do some stuff over there but yeah i'm definitely gonna get back to cora asap maybe i'll use the, maybe i'll use that week to, to record and edit a ton of cora so i have more time to um catch up on other stuff we'll see i don't know anyways yeah um all right yeah join the discord please join the discord um <laughs> you don't have to talk just join it just so we, so when people do start joining we have more people in there <laughs> um yeah make sure to sub uh like the video comment your thoughts on the season um all the good stuff any stuff, any stuff i met any stuff i might have missed holy crap learn to talk amen um yeah yeah thanks for 100 subs all right how's it going